guess what? It is, spring is almost here. It really is. As a matter of fact, we're gonna be changing our clocks back, or forward, tomorrow night, okay? I know you're like, really, that soon? Yes, because this is the time. So we've got a lawn and garden show to help you get ready for spring. And I wanna show you a couple things that we've got coming up. Now this is one, one that if you don't have yet, and maybe you've been looking for it, you can have a way to show your American pride with our 12 foot American pride flagpole. And it also comes along with the decorative eagle right there at the top. Really nice, it's brand new, and, um, and we've got that coming for you uh, featured this morning well I say brand new it's already a customer pick on hsn.com you've got free shipping you've got it on flex pay and we're going to show you as you can see right there in the video it is so simple and easy and it's going to make a big statement no matter where you decide to put it, whether this is in front of your home or in front of your place of business or what have you. So that's coming up. And if you don't wanna wait for us, if you wanna go ahead and order it now because you're saying, yeah, that's what I've been looking for, you can go ahead and get that now. Now also coming up, we have, oh, we only have about 80 of these. And this is a way for you to start to get your lawn and garden ready. This is from Earthwise. Again, a big customer pick on hsn.com. This is your eight and a half amp mini corded tiller. So when you are, you know, maybe you need to turn that ground. Maybe you are gonna be, you know, gardening and planting and you need to get that ground ready. This just makes it so much easier. You don't have to do all that back breaking work yourself. Use the tiller because it's designed to turn over the ground. So if you're seeding, if you are putting fertilizer down, if you're just getting the ground ready for planting, that's the way to go. And that one's coming up in just a moment. But let's start off with a little bit of fun. Let's start off when we go to picnics and when we go to the beach and we go to the park and we want to take all of our fun stuff, our food and our drinks and our, you know, our, our sports equipment with us. How do you do it? Do you do it in your arms and you, everybody has to carry something? Fieldsmith has a better way. This is the nylon mesh folding garden wagon with the liner. So yes, it can be your workhorse or it can be your plaything. <laughs> However you decide to have it. Let me share this with you because there's so many features in this wagon. You do have a removable liner that's easy to clean, right? You can just wipe it down or, or hose it down. Collapsible design that opens in seconds. It folds for easy storage in your car, your trunk, your back seats, your garage, your closet, whatever and it's durable, it's long lasting, it's got a steel frame design, those big huge wheels on it, and all you have to do is decide whether you want it in blue, orange, or green. And Carrie Mobley is joining us to give us all the details. Carrie, I turned my head for one second and you <laughs> folded up. When you said seconds, you weren't yeah. joking. So this is how it's gonna come to you. And by the way, this utility wagon is really lightweight. It's less than 20 pounds, so it's really easy to manage. And to set it up, you simply <laughs> unhook it, We've got a clasp on each side, and let me just show you how amazing this is. Okay. First of all, it's a great steel frame, so it's really heavy duty. This is a wagon that we had last year as well, so it's significantly bigger than any wagon that we've had on HSN, but we made some upgrades to it, and let me tell you what they are. First of all, great fun colors, but this liner in here, which is completely removable, makes messy jobs an easy cleanup. I love this. Look at this. So genuinely, you can just rinse it out with a hose. You can wipe it down. And so if you have something, let's say, like wet. Uh-huh. Like it's ice. completely waterproof. Mm -hmm. So I actually used mine exactly this way when my 13-year-old had his birthday party and we had like 30 13-year-old kids <laughs> at my house. Oh my gosh. I filled it with ice and loaded it up and turned it into basically a portable cooler. So I love the fact that we have this liner because you can use it for stuff like that. Cool. Now, because of the same features that we had last time, we can also push or pull, which might not seem like a big deal, mm -hmm. but if you're trying to navigate around things, mm -hmm. it's really nice to be able to have that direction going forward, yeah. but you can also pull it. Okay, nice. My wagons uh -huh. have this great padded handle on it, and I love it because since this can hold 100 pounds, and if you're gonna put all that weight on your hands, yeah. you might be surprised how uncomfortable some of those other wagons are, yeah. but this one with this great padded handle, I'm telling you what, it is something pretty spectacular. Oh, nice. Let me show you again how easy this setup and breakdown is. Two little clasps, 
And one of my favorite things that I'm so glad that we kept, it stands up on its own. You can see that down here, these bottom wheels turn themselves kind of into a little platform. Mm -hmm. So let's say you go to the grocery store and you are unloading your groceries and mm -hmm. now when you fold it up, Mm -hmm. It can stand up on its own. Nice. So you don't have to worry about, you know, bending over to pick right. it up. Right. Well, remember, it's only, you know, 18 and a half pounds, so it's not like it's that heavy anyway. Well, that's great. But let's just take care of our bodies, you let's, know? So, I, I, you know, let's, let's just take I care of I love that they thought of everything. And even when you are not using it and you do want to fold it up and store it, you don't have to make room, like, like you don't have to have a third driveway in your in your garage so in order true. to make room so for it true. you it, can uh, fold it up and yeah. just and pop it right there in the back seat or the or the trunk or what have you that's what you were talking about just kind of everyday use because sometimes we look at these and we think only when we're doing bigger jobs or when we're going out to play but it can be for anything I think the grocery store is a great example of this. Now, I know you probably know this. I have four boys, so when I go to the grocery store, it's like an event, okay? And I have to take several trips going in and out and oh in and gosh. out until I got this utility wagon. And I pull it out of the back of my gigantic SUV, because that's what you need to fit four boys. Yeah. And I just pop it open. Because a lot of times I do it when the boys are at school, just yeah. because I don't want to deal with them at the grocery store. Oh, right. So I can load everything in here. It's got these great big wheels, so it can go over any terrain. Mm -hmm. It just goes right into my kitchen because it's narrow enough to fit yeah. through my front door That's with true. no problem. So I'll just wheel it in, and it's one stop. Yeah. Think about those who live yeah. in an apartment building mm -hmm. or in a condo, mm -hmm. and all of the trips they have to make when they're bringing things. Mm -hmm. Pop one of these in your trunk, yeah. And you will be amazed at how right. often you're using it. I used to, you know, when I, I lived in Washington, D.C., I was in school, and when I went to the store, I could only buy as much as I could actually physically carry, which was one bag in each hand and then one bag, like, on a backpack on my back. And that was it, And which, you know, meant I didn't have a whole lot of food all the time. <laughs> but what's great about this is that now you can take or purchase or what have you however much your wagon can carry. It's not all up to you being the strong one with brute strength. This can hold up to 100 pounds. So whether it is the groceries, whether it is when you're going to the big box stores, um, maybe it is going to be when you are doing your, your work around the home, whether it's with the pool and, and, or the garden, which I will tell you, just the gardening, just the fertilizer alone is so heavy, let alone everything else. And no doubt about it. And messy and, and sloppy. Oh, yeah. So because it's got this great liner in it, not only yeah. do I use it to transport all of my gardening products, like mm -hmm. if I get back from the big box store and I have like 10 boxes or 10 bags of mulch, yeah. I just dump it all in here and mm -hmm. it can carry it no problem. So when I finally get where I'm going in my garden and I take everything out, I take my weeds, I weed and dump the weeds into here knowing that Smart. I don't have to worry about it ruining my pretty beautiful wagon. Which, by the way, yeah. how cool are these colors? I, know, I love them. I love them, too. And, you know, I, I have the orange one. Mm -hmm. I am thinking to myself, I wish that I had gotten one of every color. They're cool. They fold. You know, listen, if you think about how tightly they compact, yeah. it's a matter of inches. That's right. So you can put this in your trunk and not have to worry about it taking up, like, prime real estate in right. your trunk. Yeah. It really is super, super easy to set up and break down. Yes. and folds down so small. So again, in the garden, you can push or pull. You know, the handle goes up and down. It's got a great padded handle. And so I use mine for gardening almost as much as I use it mm -hmm. for the beach, yeah. okay, for the pool. I mean, look at this. Because you would think with four boys, I got all kinds of helpers. Yeah, no. <laughs> no, Okay, no, we no. get to the beach and they're like, beeline for the water. And yeah. I'm like, excuse me, can you please carry something? <laughs> right. Nothing. You're the one still at the trunk yes. and they're already having fun. And it's so unfair. I always yeah. thought that is just not fair. Well, I always say the person who is the one who's in charge of everything is the is the one who's having the least fun. No. Like, so when, when the kids or the family says, let's go to the beach, let's go to the park, all you're thinking is, oh my gosh, it's going to be such work, a hassle. Work, right? work, work. Now so it doesn't have to be. One trip. And you know what? Because we have these nice big wheels on it, which again, this is one of the upgrades that we made to our wagon. This nice big wheel makes it easy wow. to go over sand. This and before, good. it wasn't as easy. I mean, you could take our other ones in the sand, mm -hmm. but these wheels have been specifically designed so that you can go over all different kinds of terrain. Yeah. So you take one trip put everything in here, and then you just wheel it. And now guess what? I get to have fun too. Yeah. So I'm the one running <laughs> to the that. beach. I'm like, I'll see you guys. I'm out of here. And
and <laughs> imagine so. that you actually get to participate without having to do all of the work you're not walking through dropping things losing things because that's not going to happen the, the the wagon is not going to drop anything the wagon's not going to lose anything if you put it in there it will carry it it will roll it right where you're going to be and it's just about ease and simplicity and in this case all of the all of the upgrades that you're seeing here it's all based off of your feedback it's all based off of well we really love it but if i could you know if i if i had it my way i would have those wheels bigger guess what you got bigger wheels if i had it my way i would have the, the wagon bigger guess what it's a bigger wagon um i love the push pull aspect everything mm -hmm. of this everything about so this so well thought is so well thought out and you would think it should cost more but it doesn't matter in fact, today it's a spring price. So we've got it for you on flex pay for $26.65 in orange, green, or blue. And it does, it is literally your second and third and maybe even fourth pair of hands. Oh my gosh. And you know one of the things that I was thinking about when we were talking about the beach? There is nothing more disgusting than sand being all over your everything. <laughs> With yes. this great liner that remember, it is completely removable. I can just pull it out. Now yeah. all the sand is in here, uh -huh. right? And once I get everything taken and put into the, into the car, I can even just shake it out. And all of the sand is now left at the beach where it belongs yeah and I can just easily slide this right back in here again yeah I, I gotta tell you I'm really impressed with the uh, the modifications mm -hmm. and the changes they made mm -hmm. like you said it seems as if they have been listening mm -hmm. all along um, and I'm one of these people again with four boys we're always at baseball games I am oh, yeah. constantly loading up my wagon mm -hmm. mine I gotta tell you, has taken such a beating, but <laughs> never ever once has this great steel frame, this sturdy, I mean, this is like unbeatable material here, you yeah. know? And again, we've got a little flip on each side that you just lift up and it collapses kind of like an accordion. And now you'll see over here, the way it snaps and stays is we have a little clasp right there and it stays up by itself if I can get those bad boys. Okay. So now, you know, I don't even have to hold on to it. So I can, good. you know, be loading stuff into my car and yeah. I don't have to bend over and lift up anything. Yeah. At 18 and a half pounds, it's very lightweight. It's easy to manage, but it holds a hundred pounds. This is great. So fill it up, guys. You can fill it up with anything. It's spring cleaning time. It's yeah. gardening time. Yeah. It's soon going to be, it's going to be pool time. It's going to be. Oh my gosh, it's going to be I beach know, time. Oh, I know. And, and this is the time to really go ahead and pick yours up and get ready because it's not about, you know, oh, I'm going to the beach tomorrow. Oh, I wish I had that now. No. Order it today. You'll have it in about a week or so. And, get, and then you can get used to it. And probably the first thing that you're gonna do is you might try it out. You might start to put some of your gardening supplies in there. You might, you know, just like Carrie, you might have to go to those baseball games and soccer tournaments, which are all day. You might be the parent um, in charge of bringing the orange slices and bringing the food and the drinks for the kids that time. And now it's just gonna be less of a hassle for you. That's one less thing you have to think about and you have to um, worry about. And when feel, uh, the way Field and Stream has, I'm sorry, the way Field Smith has created mm -hmm. this, you have something that is just simple and easy. All you're doing is decide whether you want it in orange and green or in blue. What's your favorite color? I like the blue. Do you? I, I do. Like the, I, clear, I like blue too. Yeah. <laughs> I think other than the one that I have, yeah. I think my favorite is the green. It's, uh, yeah. It's such a pretty green. You know, it's, it's like that vibrant. neon. It's yeah. got a pop of color. This is Feels good. very springy. You this know? is it. Go very ahead and summery. pick up for sure. And I love that we've got it for you this morning. Brand new. You're the first ones to see it. You're the first ones to get it. So enjoy. All right. Go ahead and check out the HS on HSN.com. We've got the large origami racks, and the, you're, we've got a two-pack there. And you know, um, if you are doing some spring cleaning and you want to get things organized, that's a really great way to go because you can hold up to 2,000 total pounds with those origami large racks. So whether it's clean the garage or the attic or the basement, do it all. Also, let me tell you one other thing. Um, we always talk about our HSN card and all the benefits that you get. And if you don't have one yet, you're missing out. So call, you can apply for it. And when you're approved, guess what? You can get up to $25 off of a single item purchase. That would take that wagon that you were just looking at that I know you want 
subtract $25 from that when you've got your brand new HSN card. So definitely take advantage of that right there. All right, Carrie's staying with us for another very, very important item. And um, I think really one that brings out the patriotism in all of us, and it is this 12-foot American pride flagpole. And this is beautiful. It's, it's beyond beautiful. I have one at my house, and it's really interesting. I had no idea how much I was going to enjoy having it. Mm -hmm. It is, it's special to me. It is. And I sit outside by my fire, um, and I see my beautiful flowers that I've planted, and I see this beautiful three by five foot. You wanna grab wow, part this of this? Wow, this is big. It's big, it's three by five, it's 12 feet tall, but that's not the best part about this. It's this technology that has gone into, well, the flag itself, it's called a torsion rod, and this is patented technology that prevents the flag from ever twisting up. That's so Isn't good. Isn't that so great? Because we have a flag at home, but it's constantly twisting. Yes, that, yeah. was, I, that would drive me crazy. So that's great. But what makes this even more special is how easy it is to install. You want to know what you need to install it? Okay, let me see. This. Okay, we have that. That's it. Yeah. You don't need any cement. You don't need a wheelbarrow. <laughs> okay. You don't need a shovel. All you need is this hammer. Okay. And this is the bad boy right here. So this is our steak. And by the way, this is all high quality aircraft yeah. aluminum. Yeah. It's never going to rust. But this right here is the way you're going to install it. So you find the place in your yard. Mm -hmm. I have mine in my backyard right on the water. Okay. Gorgeous. Nice. You take your place, you find it, and you simply hammer it in all the way. I'm, okay. I promise I'm not yeah. gonna hammer <laughs> This is a big deal here, so I want to make sure. Yeah. And so it is set up in literally minutes. So, so I just hammer this in. Yes. And then I just drop these pieces right on the inside. Exactly. And this technology is great, too, because it becomes completely flush. Okay. So it doesn't look like there are multiple pieces. It looks like all one piece, as you can see, that we have displayed beautifully on our set. Isn't it gorgeous? Look at, how, look at that. Isn't it pretty? And you see what 12 feet is. It's going all the way up to the, like the peak of our roof, as you can see right there. See the way that the flag blows and it's not twisting. Oh, wait a minute. Let's talk about the topper. I know. So we have this beautiful golden eagle. Yeah. He's just gorgeous. You know, he's, yeah. a, he's a little special piece that makes us proud to be an American, yeah, right? And we are absolutely. all proud to be Americans. I love it. And um, there's something intangible about mm -hmm. the way that I feel when I sit back there. Mm -hmm. I would have never thought yeah. that something like this could make such a difference yeah. in my yard, in my feeling. I just, I, I yeah. love it, you, I love it. You know what it is too, when you see the the American flag waving in a, in a neighborhood, it's kind of contagious. Have you noticed this? You'll have one neighbor put it up, and then you'll, you know, over the next few weeks, you'll see another flag and another flag and another flag. And that's what happens. And, and so if you don't have one or one that you, that's, that's functioning the way that this one can, like I said, we have one at home, but it's always twisted. Yes. Um, it's, it frays on the end. It just wasn't a great quality material to begin with. And, and you, some, you live and learn. Right. And so then you true. know what to look for. Well, and this has everything that you would look for. So again, this is wonderful technology. It's called the torsion rod. It's patented, so nobody else is going to have it, so it'll never twist up. You can see I'm twisting, 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 but it's this great technology here. Never going to rust ever because mm -hmm. this is made with aircraft quality aluminum. Wow. I mean, they just thought of everything. Yeah. And I can't tell you how gorgeous it is. A great big flag, three feet by five feet. Look at that. And you know, the flagpole itself, by the way, it's interchangeable. If you have another okay. flag that you love, you okay. can use this great big, I'm a University of Michigan fan. Okay. I know all the Ohio State go. people just changed the channel. Is that blue? Is yes. that go blue? That's go blue. <laughs> So I can put another flag on it as well, and it will shine, it will shine just as brightly during uh, football season. Okay, yes. football season. And so it's great, so you know? It, it, that it, that it's good to know, and I'm glad that you mentioned that, too, because it does, this is primarily, you're going to pr perhaps have your American flag um, flying for the most part, but there will be times, you know, maybe you do want to change that out for the occasion, for the season. No problem there. You still have your 12-foot pole, 12 feet. You know, and again, the fact that we've got these for you here at this price is great because if you were to go out and price a, pole, a 12 foot pole like this, you know what? If you were gonna just price the flag itself, 
itself, mm -hmm. you'd be paying a good portion of this price just on the flag. So you're getting the flag, you're getting the 12 foot pole, you're getting the gold eagle that goes along the top, you're getting that easy install. I mean, it couldn't be better and this couldn't be a better time because really every time is a great time to buy the American flag. And if you've been wanting one, go ahead and give us a call or go to hsn.com. It's just, we give you the great, the best quality and it's just easier to get it here from us. And the fact that you were saying installation is one hammer. One hammer. And you just choose the spot where you want it to be. I mean, listen, you don't have to wait for your husband to come home from work. This is something that I did all by myself. And I yes. mean, it's, listen, it's also International Women's Week. Women's I'm gonna yeah. stick with it the whole right, week. I'm with you. I don't need anybody's help with this. <laughs> I brought it outside simply with a hammer and I hammered it in all the way in until we got this flush with the ground. Okay. And so it's got a great sturdy base. You just want to make sure, of course, that you don't have any sprinkler heads down there, any okay. gas lines. But okay. I just put mine out, you know, beyond my lanai. And it's the fact that it comes with the flag already on it. It's a super simple setup. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Take each of these poles, yeah. pop one in. Pop the other in. Yeah, and they're you not see, even heavy so either. Yeah. Oh, they're very, very lightweight. Yeah. It's so lightweight because it's aluminum, mm -hmm. which is great because it's also never going to rust. Mm -hmm. So the install is really easy. Go onto hsn.com. Mm -hmm. Read the customer reviews. You would be amazed. Mm -hmm. Everybody is so impressed with the ease of the setup yeah. and with the pure pleasure that they're getting from it. Absolutely. Pure if, pleasure. If you are, and, I, and this is something that I haven't seen us present um, here at HSN, and I've been here for over 10 years, and you know we've got thousands, tens of thousands of different kinds of products, but I dare say this is probably the most important. I dare say this is the one that every household should have. And maybe you're the, maybe you're the person who says, I've been wanting a flag to represent your patriotism. Maybe you have a, a member of your family who's in the military and you don't see them very often, but every time you see a flag, you think of them. Wouldn't you love to be able to look out your front window or your back window? and see that flying very proudly and knowing that you were able to install that without any problems mm. and it's and it's going to look that beautiful when the wind is blowing when it's a sunny day and that's it's what you so get to true. see. Yeah. And I don't, you know, my, my dad was in the military, yeah. my brother was in the military, but my husband isn't, and mm -hmm. I'm not. And even still, I think to myself, why do I love this so much? Yeah. But the way you say it, when I see it flying, yeah. I feel, it, it feels special. It does. And it's great, great quality. It's yeah. gigantic, three foot by five look at how, foot. Look at how big this is. We're both holding it, and there's still space for other folks. Go ahead and pick yours up while we've got it. Carrie, thank you so My much. My pleasure, thank We've you. We've got more coming up. Stay with us here at HSN. I love that. I know. Come discover new products with me, Adam Freeman, on the Monday Night Show. This week, it's a three-hour special edition starting at 6 p.m. Let's celebrate the finalists of the Project American Dreams competition, supporting Latino entrepreneurs. We launch their dream products live. Plus, we announce the winner of the Good Housekeeping Seal. Hint, it's someone who sold out from our first American Dreams competition. See you Monday at 6. I've spent a lifetime in the kitchen all over the world. And I've seen what it takes to make cooking easier, faster, and more simple. You don't need a professional kitchen to be able to cook a delicious meal. With the right kitchen tools, you'll be able to cook, create, and celebrate. Don't miss the return of Curtis Stone's Kitchen Solutions, only on HSN. Since 1939, HP has been an industry leader in technology, offering innovative, practical products at a great value. It's a tradition they carry on to this day. HP puts innovation at your fingertips. From desktops to laptops and printers to tablets, HSN has the latest in HP technology, so you can stay productive and stay connected wherever life takes you. HP, make it matter. Saturday on HSN. So 
I promised you lawn and garden in this hour, and you can see that we're delivering. Let me share with you, our next item is gonna help you with your lawn and gardening. And maybe for you, it is preparing the soil because you are about to do some planting um, or, or, you know, uh, turning over that soil or fertilizing or what have you. We have a tiller that's going to help you do it so that you don't physically have to do all of that hard backbreaking work yourself. This is from Earthwise. When you hear Earthwise, I want you to think of really great, high quality outdoor tools that are designed, that are easy enough for you to use. This is that great eight and a half amp mini corded tiller, and we're gonna show you how to use it. Peter Kilcullen's joining us, but I will tell you, Peter and I have presented this before. We had a right. lot more the last time we presented it. Yeah. We're down to fewer than a hundred of them, all right? so. Here we go. Well, I mean, think, I think what you said is so true. You know, when you're trying to get a jump start on that gardening season, you know, waiting for that first warm day, <laughs> this is actually gonna give you even a bigger head start and it's gonna make it so much easier. So think about all the weeding that you have to start the season out with. Think about trying to just break that soil, dig down in there, whether it's on your hands and knees or a shovel or a metal rake to try to loosen that soil so you can plant. This tiller makes it so simple. And now you're thinking, well, I've never, thought about a tiller before. I don't really have yeah. a great big farm, but check this out, how small it is, how lightweight it is, but you are gonna see some amazing performance that's gonna let you just take out all the hard work. So check this out, I'll fire this up. And you can see those four tines that are spinning 350 RPM, and watch how this is gonna be able to dig down in that soil and start to just turn it Look at that as I bring it back. Now we're really getting down into that soil. So look at that, just that one wow. pass that I made right there. Look at that. So what you have is, and now we just started tilling this area mm -hmm. yesterday. This had all these plants and flowers, so there's still a lot of roots and things in here. But what we have is 11, and a half, 11 inches wide in that path. We have eight and a half inches deep that we can do. But what I've done is I've, I've loosened that soil. Mm -hmm. You know, there's some, there's still some roots and things in here, but all of this is turned up. I'm able to take all of this out, meaning here's all it takes to start planting. That's I it. can plant just with my hands now, taking out your plants. It can be those trays of the small flowers, certainly the vegetables. You can buy the seedlings. You're planting those. You could plant row after row faster than ever That's without right. all the backbreaking work. Really, without that, the, the weeding part, I think, is the, the, you so know, the early season yeah. headaches when it comes to gardening. It How, is. It, it, this changes it. it. It really does, because when you think about it, too, the actual planting, the putting the plants in the ground, that takes no time. That's right. like, you know, I don't know, 30 seconds per plant, if that. It's the preparing the soil that takes half the day, isn't it? So if I can do it with a tiller that's this quick, and, and just like Peter said, there are still some roots under there. Did you notice the tiller didn't have problems with that? Now, I don't know if you've got like a big 100-year-old oat tree, not suggesting you till that area, right. but for the area that you are gonna plant, this just makes it simple. We're gonna take you we're going to take you on a tour of the tiller so that you can see how it works yeah. underneath. So again, and then you saw in some of that video where you can use this and there's everyone on hsn.com says the same thing. So if you get a chance to look at those, mm -hmm. they say how much power it had, how surprised they were at how much work it was able to do. And there you can see it those four times. That's what's turning and then in turn turning up the soil. So softening that soil, whether you have very hard soil or hard packed clay, this is going to make it easier. This also, what's important important about this is how small it is because now you're able to make those smaller rows maybe it's in between existing plants and flowers like we have here oh, yeah. it's going to be perfect moving this in and out of the the shed or the garage is easy there's a carry handle it weighs about 25 pounds okay. you can roll it out because it does have the wheels on the back mm -hmm. we have all the safety uh, involved in here as well. We have a safety switch and when you let go of this bail arm it completely stops if you let go in any way it is simple. So there's mm -hmm. that bail arm. I close that yeah. when it's on. When I let go, you're set right. to go. But obviously, you see, when I close that bail arm, yeah. it doesn't start automatically unless you hit that safety switch. I like so that. again, let me show you how that works. We were able to make that one row right there. I hit that button. That's the safety switch. I squeeze that bail arm. And now I'm ready to go. And what I love about this is that you're in control. I can push that further into the soil, oh, wow, yeah. slowly work it back. But look at how much soil it's turning. Look at what it's able to do, whether it's hard packed ground, whether there are roots, mm -hmm. whether there are weeds, you are gonna be set. 
I Look mean, the planting, that. I mean, it really does such a great job. Everyone says they're impressed, they're yeah. surprised by the amount of power that you're getting. Uh -huh. But this is making gardening not only easier, not mm -hmm. only a little bit quicker, not only allowing you to do the biggest garden ever, yeah. but this is gonna make the soil so much better for those plants. That's so right. we're gonna get what we really want. Amazing results, Amazing right? Amazing results, because you're not just kind of, like you said, scratching the surface. You're actually getting down so that the nutrients are coming up because all of the nutrients really kind of settle to the bottom of, of where the soil is, that soil base. So it's nice when you can turn that over, uh, whether, you, whether you're seeding, whether you're planting regular plants, what, whatever the case is. What I also like is that this is corded. There is no gas which means you don't have fumes, you don't have the, the, um, the expense of the gas, or, you know, can, transporting gas can be a bit problematic and you don't have that. You notice there are no loud operating noises, so you don't have to wait until everybody in the neighborhood is up before right. you start doing your gardening. You could do it at 8.30 in the morning and you're not disturbing everybody, which is gonna be great. It does cut that nice path of 11 inches wide and up to eight and a half inches deep. And you saw all Peter did was turn it on, push it, pull it, and it's ready to go. And that's all you're gonna do as well. So you don't have to be a gardener in order to know how to do this. You just have to say, okay, this is where I wanna plant my garden. I'm gonna start with the tiller. I'm gonna go get the plants or the, or the flowers or the exactly. vegetables or whatever it is and get to work. Maybe you just have a large area that you've never been able to tackle because it's become too much work. You love gardening, but it's become too much work. This changes all that. So you've got an area, maybe it's just the grass and the grass never grew that well. Yeah. You wanna really increase the size. And for many of us, it's a vegetable garden. I say this is a really just a powerful tool to get that great vegetable garden. Cause here's what you're gonna do. You find that grass area. Yeah. It's maybe got hard soil, especially right now, the ground's a little frozen. Mm -hmm. Grab this tiller, get it out there. Then if you wanna make you know changes to that soil improve that soil so let me just show you I've got some pea moss back here and I'm just throwing that into the soil okay. so again you can improve the quality of the soil by dumping that into the grass okay. or into the grass into your garden and then how about fertilizer so I can open this up I can put the fertilizer in that soil as well so now using the tiller the cultivator, we can improve that soil mm -hmm. by being able to mix all those things together and make it even easier to improve that soil. Again, all of these things improving your results. That's right. Improving that garden. And I mean, that's such a great look at what this can do, how it yeah. can really get down into that soil and do a great job. Right. I want to show you this as well. Okay, just to let you know, we're getting down to our final wow. quantities. We're just, just a few dozen of these left. So you can see with the wheels on there, this is a great look at it, you've got your wheels. So when you're first starting out, leave those wheels down and you're able to have a lot of control. But as you get a little more experience with it and you really wanna get down even deeper, we, this allows you to pull this pin and fold those wheels up, they lock into place. So now with the wheels up, I'm able to get even further down to that full eight and a half inches down into the soil. So let me put that out here. Okay. And start that up again, push that button, squeeze that bail arm. And now you're gonna oh, see, yeah. this is incredible. And I can tell already in this area how we're improving that soil. You're mixing that soil, tilling that soil, and it really, becomes incredible what you're able to do with this. I like when I get to these new areas and I can yeah. see how hard that soil is, uh -huh. but just a few seconds later, it's loosened, Yeah. it's tilled perfectly. I mean, that's pretty nice. And, and think about all of that, uh, that fertilizer that you put in, that is now circulated into the soil too. You're, and we have a, a small area, as you can see right here. So you can use this for a small area, which is gonna be great. Right, it's right. not a huge tiller that you feel like you have to have a, a acreage for. You can use this for a small area. You can even use this if you have a larger area because it's so simple. If you can push a vacuum, you can <laughs> right. till. And it really is as simple as that. Let me tell you, because we only have a few dozen of these left, we were planning to air this later on in the week. I, unless we get more quantity in, I don't, I, it's not happening, okay? Right. You just don't have enough. And this is the time, even if it's still cold where you are, you're probably into the last cold snap of the season. Order it today, you'll have it in about a week to 10 days and you will be ready because when that, when the sun does shine, you're gonna <laughs> want to start to put those plants in the ground and be ready and the, have the flowers around your home. And it's, as Peter 
as Peter picks up the alternative. It's so much better than that. I, I remember this thing where you, you're standing up on the shovel. Oh, I mean, there's no just, way. You don't want to be doing that when you can have something like this that can turn that soil. So once you get down to the, the easy part, mm. the planting, you can just scoop out that dirt, right. put that seedling in the ground, and you're ready to go. So right now, I want you to picture row after row of vegetables. Maybe it's the tomato oh, plants, and yeah. you want to have that first really nice tomato in the neighborhood. You can do it because this gives you a jump start, and you don't have to think about, well, how in the world am I going to weed, loosen, and then plant yeah. this large area? You can do it. Just take one look at this right here, and the way it turns the soil. Please look at hsn.com. Mm -hmm. And here, look, we can even be a little delicate. Let's get all those weeds out. And look, we're not damaging those flowers Good near point. it. So think about those areas around the house. This is gonna make such a difference mm -hmm. where you're not gonna have to weed, you're not gonna have to use that shovel and do this thing oh, to gosh. loosen the soil. You're gonna be able to improve the soil by mixing in nutrients and, and other types of soil, mixing it together. You're going to get better results. So that's the thing we wanna focus on, better results with less work. Yeah. And maybe before you've never thought about a tiller because when someone said a tiller, I'm thinking a big gas power thing, you have to start it, yeah. it's expensive. Here, you have something that's gonna make every year you garden easier than ever. That's and right. And you're going to get just amazing results. So right. yeah. understand, you can definitely handle this. You can, and it, and it may even open up some spaces that previously you hadn't thought about gardening because sure. the thought of using that shovel is just the last thing you want to do. I, you know, have you ever used a shovel, you stood on it, you've leaned on it and still nothing? <laughs> you couldn't break the soil because it was so hard down there or because may maybe there were roots. This just makes it simple and it brings the actual fun back to gardening. Maybe you used to have fun and, and you'd say, well, I would garden more, but you know, I, I, I've, you know, I'm a little bit older. I can't really kind of do that back breaking work anymore. It's just not for me. Get the tiller, it's a lot faster. And then when it's time for you to actually put the plants in the ground, you're gonna be done in no time. We wanna show you in our last, in our last couple seconds, just, just to let you know, we're down to fewer than five dozen left, okay? Fewer than five dozen left of this tiller. And, and it's corded, you just plug in your yeah, um, that's all extension you need. cord. Add your extension cord and you're ready to go. But I wanna show you again the rows that you can make, just a perfect row right there where you can now plant and basically you're dropping those seedlings in by hand. You're exactly right. All you need is that extension cord. It's super easy to just put the handle on and you're ready to go. It has a handle on it so carrying it in and out of the, the garage is simple and easy or check this out with the wheels on it. You're just going to roll that around. It's very simple but look at that. You can see those tines. They do an amazing job. Everyone says the same thing. I didn't expect really to have as much power as it has. I was blown away by how powerful. I think the first review I read last time, it yeah. said the little tiller that they could, could, right? We, we talked about that last time. Yeah. Because everyone's impressed that the power is there. So you're going to get great results turning up that soil, and then you're gonna get great results when those plants bloom and grow, and you'll be so excited. Biggest garden ever. I know, and you can do it early, too. You don't have to wait for the ground to completely thaw and, right. and all of that, because now you have, you know, the power in the palm of your hand. Uh, four dozen left. We'll let you know when it's gone. Go ahead and get yours now. And you can get it on FlexPay for $34.99. All right? Now, coming up in about one minute from now, we have something else from Earthwise. This is that electric 10-inch pole saw. We say 10-inch because the blade is 10 inches, but the pole saw itself is going to be able to allow you, with that extender and with the, uh, with the height on that, to get up to those tree branches that need to be cut down, that need to be pruned, and you can do it so easily without having to call somebody else to come over and do it for you. You can do that. It's coming up in just a few moments. We're gonna check in with a quick break and then come back for more with that Earthwise. For the first time ever, for one week only, we're celebrating HSN's best in beauty. HSN.com has never before seen exclusive daily deals on brands like Lancome, Barack, Serious Skin Care, Benefit, and more. Enjoy four flex pay on all beauty brands and up to 50% off beauty products from top brands. It's a one week beauty bash you don't want to miss. Head over to HSN.com and search best in beauty. How you doing, HSN? 
hosting a TV show is the best thing ever. And what I did not realize is that my clothing would become a co-star. Women wait for those doors to open and they look to see what I'm wearing. My line is for all women, whether you're a size two or a size 22. Clothing should not be really expensive and it should not be that complicated. <laughs> It's a tale as old as time. Papa? And now, this Wednesday, HSN presents Beauty and the Beast like never before in this year's most anticipated shopping event. Experience 25 enchanting hours of exclusive limited time collections inspired by the unforgettable fairy tale. Shop now at hsn.com and join us this Wednesday for the Beauty and the Beast shopping event on HSN. See the movie in theaters Friday, rated PG. There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. FlexPay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. HSN, we've got one more product in our lawn and garden show, and this is going to be one that is going to mean that you can now do all of those, all of that pruning, all of that, you know, cutting down of those errant branches that are hanging too low or rubbing against the roof or what have you without having to call somebody to do it for you. This is one of our 10 faves, and it's going to be one of your favorites as well. This is from Earthwise. So again, whenever you hear Earthwise, I want you to think quality outdoor products that always have those safety features that make the DIYer comfortable doing it themselves. This is the electric 10 inch pole saw. 10 inches on the blade, but super long on the extension. So you can actually reach the trees when you need to. All you have to do is decide which color you want. I like that Earthwise makes it fun. We've got orange, yellow, purple. This is um, gonna be teal. And we also have it for you in camouflage if you wanna get real fancy and peter is standing by to show us how to use it exactly let's go right to it let's start cutting with this nine and a half foot pole saw i mean it's it's incredible this has become our most popular outdoor item because it allows everyone to do jobs that they just couldn't possibly do before or maybe never considered before look at how simple that is what i love about this is Look at how I'm not fighting with the saw. There's very little vibration, just nice and easy, working its way through that limb. And we don't have, uh, honestly, that's not a little baby limb there, is it? I mean, that's a, you want me to grab that? That's a, that's a pretty good size, right? I mean, what is, that's about a four inch on diameter. So again, this is perfect for firewood, things like that. And this can handle it. And it does it just nice and smooth. Yeah. So as we were talking about, you have a 10 inch bar and chain, which is a little bit, you know, atypical in that you normally would maybe have an eight inch bar and chain. So that allows you to get even bigger branches like this or to cut it for firewood. But this is such an amazing tool. So think yeah. about this. We're able to cut all that. Mm -hmm. it, it's nine and a half feet long. And then wow. plus how tall you are, you can extend it overhead. And this entire thing weighs less than nine pounds. Wow. Less than nine pounds. Now, the, the reason why that is, is we have a lightweight hollow fiberglass tube. What that does, it also helps to reduce weight, obviously, but also reduces vibration. So it's easier for you. You're not holding on, trying to fight this saw. Yeah. It is very simple to use. Yeah. The 10 inch bar and chain is right here. So this 10 inches here allows you to cut longer or, or larger limbs and logs. This is an Oregon bar and chain, which is the industry standard. Even on those much more expensive and scary gas powered, mm -hmm. they have the same Oregon bar and chain. Automatic lubrication system, so it'll automatically oil that bar and chain. All you have to do is keep the oil in this reservoir. And you can okay. see right there, we even have a window to okay. let you know that there's oil in there. Oil in there. You yeah. turn it on, you're set to go. It's never difficult to start. You always start it up. Just like with our tiller, 
you just add your extension cord and you are basically ready to go. And look at what you're doing. Look at, you know, because if you have trees around your home, then you're gonna have some things that, you know, periodically have to be cut and trimmed. I love that you were talking about that, it cuts down on the vibration, because do you see what Peter cut? Do you see it's not jagged? in any way, it is so smooth. This could be a coaster. This could right. be a drink coaster. It's that great. It is so smooth, it's not jagged. So it didn't rip up and eat and, and, and tear into that branch. It gave it, gave it a nice clean cut. So when you are doing this around your home, you don't have to have any concern about um, not having that nice clean cut every single time. We're gonna go back over and see more, but do recognize this is something that you can actually use. No question. Yeah. I mean, we have so many testimonials and calls from yeah. people just talking about that they used to have to pay so much to have those limbs cut. Yeah. But if you look at this, I have it now sitting on the ground, but you can see that it's nine and a half feet tall without me even picking it up, which is so amazing. So now when I pick this up, and I'm just over six feet tall, I, I'm reaching 12, 13 feet in the air, and that's really pretty high, because I think if you went outside your house right now and you looked at some of those branches, they're close to the windows, maybe on the roof, mm -hmm. maybe the branches that start to hang over the driveway and they get really close to the cars, mm -hmm. I bet you'll find that many of those are only eight or nine feet in the air, yep. you'll be able to cut all of those back with this saw and it'll make it so easy, you can do it yourself. Now, right now we're coming out of the winter time, so you're gonna have a lot of down limbs, you're gonna have some dead trees, you're gonna be able to immediately when the spring comes or your first warm day, you're able to cut those all back. Maybe you have down limbs, the storms, if you have a lot of trees on your property, they're all down everywhere, you yeah. can cut those, cut them to length for firewood or to just get rid of them. This allows you to do it. How about this? This. this also has this pivoting head on here that allows you to select different positions. So when you're using this overhead, that angle makes it even easier to just rest this on top of the branch and let it work its way through. So you're gonna love that as well. You know what, I'll leave that in that position because I wanna show you this a little bit higher up on our simulated tree we have here. <laughs> okay. Because what's gonna happen is when you're, when you're using this, you don't wanna stand directly beneath the limb as you're cutting it, so you wanna be able to reach in at a 45 degree angle. So I'll just rest that up there so you can see that. So now I'm going straight up and then it angles. The other nice thing about this is, so if I go this way, now you're able to see that that motor is all in line. Mm -hmm. A lot of these pole saws will have the motor on one side, so it makes it yeah. difficult to see when you're trying to cut. Here, yeah. when you're looking up, you can clearly see what you're trying to cut. So I just turn that on and I let it rest on that limb. Wow, that and was no you, time. Exactly, now our tree vibrates more than yours will at home. Yeah. But watch how I just rest that on the limb. And you can see when it's a smaller limb, like that's just about a, a one inch in diameter limb. Yeah. I mean, you're cutting through those that's very right. quickly. That limb didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Not at all. It didn't stand a chance. And this is the thing too, Peter, you're so right. If you have to call somebody and hire somebody to come over and um, cut and do that kind of pruning that you need done around your home, they can charge who knows what. They might quote you something on the phone, but then they get up to your house and they kind of look around and they might charge you more. And I will tell you, because we've had to, in the past, have people come around and cut some of the limbs off of our trees. Um, with this, we could have done it ourselves. We paid a lot more for one cut for one tree than sure. what you're getting to use this any time and every time that you possibly could need it and want it. And the fact that, as Peter's showing you, it is as easy as it looks because the, the saw itself is doing all the work. You're not doing any kind of movement. You just decide what you want to cut, put it on that spot, turn it on, and the saw just gives you that nice, clean cut every single time. I want you to see more too, yep. because again, it's about the, how to use it. Right, it weighs less than nine pounds, and you're absolutely right, you, you're not gonna have to call someone every season. Even if you have great big trees and they're really high in the air, the ones that are prob problematic are the ones that are close to you. You can reach those with this, so maybe you only have to call those people to cut those upper limbs you know, every two years or more instead of twice a year. This helps you do that. Now you're thinking, well I've never used a chainsaw or a pole saw before, is it going to be difficult? So easy. And again, 
again, Earthwise has kept safety in mind. So when I go to pull that trigger, nothing happens unless I also hit that safety switch. So I have to hit that, then pull the trigger, and then I can just hold on to the trigger. But as soon as I let go, everything stops. The noise stops, the chain stops, and then if I try to go back to it, I still have to engage that safety switch. All you're doing right here is adding your extension cord, and that's it. You're never gonna have to pull start. You're never gonna have to you know, mm -hmm. try to figure out how to start it and get the gas. All you need to do is keep the oil in there. So let's go back to this large limb so you can see that, how, it, how well it cuts. I'm gonna straighten that out so it'll be easier for you to see there. So I loosen that, put that all the way straight, tighten that up just like that. So you never need any tools to do that. And now all I'm gonna do is typically turn that on and then just rest it down on that limb. And then again, just as you were talking about camera, yeah. I'm not trying to saw the wood. Right. I'm just letting it work its way through. And what happens is, I think the, the front part of the saw weighs about six pounds, and you've got just under three pounds for the pole. That weight is just working its way through mm -hmm. that limb, whether you're up above or down low or just using it to demonstrate like we are here. But it does such a great job. You don't have to do anything. And in particular, you don't have to hold on for dear life. <laughs> it makes it so simple to just cut through there. That's what I like about it. You're, you're never feeling like it can get away from you. You're never feeling like, well, I, I've got to hold on and struggle with it, and there's, there's no motion that you have to do. It just yeah. makes it simple, but it has the right amount of power to do the, the job correctly. You know, it's kind of like that, you know, the, a sharp knife in mm -hmm. a kitchen when you're, when you're cutting vegetables and things. That can be safer and easier to use than a dull knife yeah. because it's not the right tool for the job. This is the perfect tool every single time. That's and right. you don't have to do anything. Keep oil in that reservoir and you are set. And that's it. I mean, again, this is Earthwise makes it safe, makes it easy for the DIYer because we do recognize you're not professionals. You know, we are not, you know, tree trimmers and gardeners, you know, maybe if that's not your profession, but you do have the wherewithal to know that you want to do it yourself. And now you have the tools and they're not expensive. And all you're doing is deciding which color you want. And again, I like that Earthwise just gave you some fun options. This is camouflage. This is teal, this is the one that Peter was using. We've got it in purple, we have yellow, and we also have orange. So which one are you picking up for yourself? And um, I will tell you, don't loan it out because you're not gonna get it back. <laughs> because the minute somebody uses this and sees how easy it is, they're gonna kind of want to claim it for themselves. And it really is. There are other alternatives, and maybe you've seen those <laughs> too. And I see this gas can, I, I'm familiar with that. Here's what you don't need. I mean, this is what you were talking about. I mean, you're not a professional. You're trying to trim some of those branches. So a handheld chainsaw like this, not only is this intimidating and, and it does have this thing that you're going to have oh. to pull and start. And I love always, you know, this is more than you need. And you can <laughs> see like all the instructions on the back and your primer bulb to get this started. You just don't need any of these things. And also... The majority of us are thinking, well, all the branches I have are up <laughs> above, so, right. you know, what this isn't going to, I'm not chopping down trees. I want to prune those trees. I want to trim those trees. I want to open up that canopy when it leads up to your front door. And you can do that because those branches are really 10 feet or less above the ground. You can reach them, but not with this on a ladder, but with that pole saw that extends to nine and a half feet. That's nine and a half feet before you reach up over your head. So again, tall or small, you're mm -hmm. still gonna be reaching 10, 12 feet in the air yeah. without a problem. There you can see, you can pivot that head so it's at the perfect angle when you reach up overhead and you're gonna love using that. So whether I pivot it all the way or just a tiny bit, maybe I'll just do it in the middle this time. Okay. How about just a tiny bit on that angle? So you just get a slight angle and I've extended it, not all the way, but I've extended it a little bit further. So now I'll reach up there again. And again, you're from such a distance that it's, it's easy. I can, I'll just move out in front. So I just start Start that and let it rest right on that branch and that's it. Just let it rest on that limb. And it's so simple to do. I'll move over to this other branch on the other side. Again, very simple. Let it rest on that limb and just work its way through. I mean, you can, you're almost just letting all the weight fall down on that branch mm -hmm. when it's on and it just works its way through and you'll find that it's so simple that you'll be cutting back all those branches that are, that are you know, causing issue. Mm -hmm. And the great thing is probably right now, 
you can identify all those branches because <laughs> we just came out of all the winter storms. If yeah. you had snow and it causes those branches to get really close to the windows and the cars, mm -hmm. get out there and trim those now. Then you're going to have all this growth through the spring and the summer. Yeah. You can get out there and keep trimming them back. Remember, some of these trees and plants and things, they're going to benefit the more you trim them back. That's very you, true. They're going to grow the way you want. But I think one of the areas you're going to find is a big difference is if you look at your house mm -hmm. and you've let these trees kind of get out of control, yeah. it starts to close up the house. Yeah. Maybe it's, you know, you have the picture windows in the front of the house and the walkway up to the house. Yeah. All of a sudden, there's all these trees. When you cut those back and you open it up, it'll give your home a whole new look, something that Absolutely. you've forgotten about. Absolutely. So this yeah. is a great way to do that yourself you will be amazed that you can do it and it's really simple. That's right. I'm glad that you mentioned that too. So, so for some of the, the things that we're going to be cutting, the trees and the branches, it's necessity. It's hitting the branches, hitting the window, the branches on the roof and you don't want anything to damage your roof. For some of them, it is going to be aesthetic. Like Peter mentioned, you want to open up your house. You want, So from, from the outside, your house has more of an open, brighter feel. But also from the inside, when you cut away all of that over growth of trees your house is going to be brighter on the inside and it's just because you don't have all the darkness of the trees covering up this is a pole as you can see that uh it telescopes to nine feet six inches that's just the pole again if you are another you know six feet tall you add that and you can get up really high with that it's a lightweight fiberglass pole, so it's not going to be heavy for you to use. You've got a three-head position, straight 15 degrees and 30 degrees. And then it's got that automatic bar and chain oiling. You just leak, keep a little bit of oil in that top spot, and you're done. That's your maintenance. So again, it's not like you're buying something that you're going to have to now become, an, you know, become a, 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 a pole saw expert in. Earthwise is the pole saw expert. Did you also notice that to get up as high as Peter did, he didn't have to get on a ladder because the idea of a chainsaw and a ladder, not smart. We've all seen those YouTube videos. Right. You don't want to do that. This is a smart way to do it. Yeah, it's just unnecessary. And again, if you didn't hear me mention it earlier, this weighs less than nine pounds. So if you're thinking it's not something you can handle at nine pounds, you can do this. So I changed the limb that we had out front. So it's a little smaller, but I wanted to show you that we can just do multiple cuts and keep going through that limb as we go again you can see how it just works its way through nice and easy i can keep going you mentioned that it's automatically oiling that bar and chain we have an oregon bar and chain which is really the industry standard you are going to be amazed at what you can do with this just keep cutting through that limb as soon as I let go of that trigger, it all stops, the noise stops, and if I went right back to that trigger, nothing happens unless I hit that safety switch. So you're gonna feel great using this all the time. Lightweight fiberglass yeah. pole, it's hollow, that's what makes it lightweight, reduces all that vibration, and as you saw with that, there's, there's not much vibration to control as it is. We have a cushioned handle down here, makes it so simple, mm -hmm. you just loosen that collar, I can extend it all the way out to nine and a half feet, so nine and a half feet weighs less than nine pounds. I mean, it's an amazing design, and you will get a tremendous reach. I suggest you get this now, yeah. and by tomorrow morning when it's light out, you yeah. walk outside and you'll say you know what all these branches are so close yes they're not so high you will be able to get many 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 of those branches with this pole saw for sure true. and and i um and we're down to our last like minute and a half in this hour i want to make sure that you do get yours and it's so funny too because sometimes if we do have to and i picked this one up just so that you could see that when peter talks about it's not heavy you don't have to be a bodybuilder in order to be able to pick this up and use it and be able to maneuver it okay because you've got the weight of it is going to be at the front and then you also have that handle going along the back the purple that i have in my hands we've got fewer than four dozen left in purple just so that you know in case you were wondering but if you had to pay somebody to come over and cut what peter just cut the high branches and things like that you might say well in order to get my money's worth i'm gonna wait till i have more to cut but in waiting you might be causing more damage to your roof you might be causing more damage to your windows all those branches that are hitting those those delicate areas of your home you might be you know just kind of bringing down the look of your home because you're saying if i'm going to pay somebody i'm going to wait until there's a lot to cut but if you had this whenever you see a branch that needed to be cut you go ahead and do it and guess what the job's done you don't have to have a list you don't have to keep thinking about it you just go pick it up turn it on 
cut it down and it's done. That's one less thing for you to have to handle. And it's because Earthwise has made this simple. So I'm glad that we have this for you at the start of the season. Yes. Because spring is on the way. <laughs> Don't forget to change your clocks forward tomorrow night. Tomorrow? It's tomorrow. Can you believe it? No, I, know. <laughs> I really can't, but that does mean it's spring, yes. so that's good. But yeah, I mean, this great time to get this spring. You'll use it all spring and summer, and don't forget, most important, use this in the fall before yep. those winter storms. I know Absolutely. I'm getting ahead of myself, No, it's, you're going to love it prepared. for that. Thank you, Peter. Thank and we're going to see you later on this afternoon, yes. later on today and this afternoon. Stay on the phone for your Earthwise, your Tiller, if we still have any of those left, any the, the, the field steep, uh, products that we had earlier. And I will see you again tomorrow morning. Valerie Stepp is coming up next.